He's got mallard in him. He's pretty. Great. There is a hen. I just heard her. There's two. Two drakes. Look at these geese. Take a video of the geese. That's a big old tree. gander. They're they're used to people with saltines. <laughs> Bonnie and Clyde trade days. Well, this turned out to be productive. I didn't even I only went down one row. I got a whole bunch of hacksaw blades from my buddy Ricky. Those are uh, about inch and seven eighths, inch and five eighths. This is a chainsaw sharpener from my buddy John. My wife got her a plant, and I'm fixing to go back. This is just round one here. Bev, Charlie wanted you to see what you were missing, not coming out. And there's way. What? Okay, I'm I'm coming. They're all six dollars. Six all bucks. The, all the baskets, six dollars. Okay. There's even some more on the on the other side over there.
Otis, you good boy? Can you shake? Can you shake? Miniature Brahma bull. Huh. Cool. All right, we're back home. Uh, picked this up for just a few dollars. It's brand new, never been used. The blade is brand new. Uh, plugged it in. It works great. Self-explanatory how it works. This is from my buddy John. These are for Ricky. Uh, Ricky, I got eight of these. I'm going to send you five. These are two inches by uh, two inches by 22. That's a lot of knives there. Well, that's probably that's ten knives there. That's five. I uh, got an axe, a uh, sledgehammer handle with a wedge for five dollars. And I got something else that uh, uh, I got it for three bucks, and I'll show you what it is. It's a it's a what's it? Somebody just tried to spam my well drilling video, and uh, it's a Romanian company. I, I translated this to English using the Google Translator, and I just want to show you something funny. Really, it's a very strange translation. Something's lost in the translation. Are you ready for this? <laughs> what a cheap and quality stink, stinky. Uh, we're here to help. Uh, no thanks, I can do my own stinkies just fine. <laughs> Inquire for a stink. Well, that's funny right there. That is funny. I guess that's all the funny, but uh, yeah, apparently they have a problem with stinkies over there in Romania. Okay. You are, you are one funny girl. Do that noise. Do that noise. Do that noise. <laughs> you funny thing, you.
Chima, Chima, good girl. Chima, somebody girl. Chima, somebody. <laughs> Do my funny girl. Do it. That is Do a happy it. face right there. You a happy face. <laughs> you a happy. Uh. And Sunny, she's protecting us from the TV uh, dogs. Oh, oh, this is the one I want to hear. The TV dogs have been trying to get us. Okay, turn it on. Uh, I'm going to tell you the what's it now, but before I do, I wanted to say thank you to Rick, Arkansas Prepper, for sending this to me. That's going to help me uh, pick up my Wi-Fi out in my shop. Uh, I want to say thank you to my other friend, Rick, uh, Rick Wallace Knife Works, for sending me that little skinner. That's very nice. Thank you. You didn't have to do that, man. I appreciate it, though. I really do. Uh, now, here's the what's it. I, uh, oh, first let me back up, uh, the guy with a chainsaw that was cutting, a, that was like shaping a bear out of the log, well, I intended to go back and, and film some of the finished product, but my wife got real tired and she wasn't feeling good, so we just left, but on the way out, I hit one more booth on the way out, and I found this, and this is the what's it, I got it for three dollars, and I didn't know what the heck it was, and here's here's how it moves. I thought perhaps it was something. Here, I'll move back a little bit. Maybe for net making. And uh, I picked it up. It was three bucks. I just had to have it just because it was a a curious piece. And I came home and I did God about an hour worth of research, and I found out it's called. A speed shuttle. Uh, this is called the Susan Burr, B-U-R-R, -R, speed shuttle. Uh, it was patented in 1880 and made by a company called Feister, P-F-I-S-T-E-R, in Torrington, Connecticut, up until the early 70s. So uh, this could be, actually, uh, what I read was the amount of screws determines the age, and I think this is like 60s. So here's what it is. It's uh, to make uh, hooked rugs, and you just take burlap and you like run yarn or fabric through here and through this hole up here, and then you poke it into the burlap and you push that and it pushes it in, and then when you pull it back, this thing walks over to the next hole in the burlap, and you do it again and you just like make a design. So uh, <clears throat> I just thought that was a pretty cool what's it. So I take it out to my wife who's now sitting in the living room and I tell her that all this stuff that I had just figured out and all the research I'd done. And she goes, yeah, that's a speed shuttle. <laughs> so all I had to do was ask my wife. I figured she'd know what it was. And uh, I was going to just offer it to somebody. If anybody knew what it was, they could have it. But my wife said she wants it. She's going to do some uh, rugs. And... Uh, she reminded me that she asked me to make a frame to stretch some burlap on, and I do remember her asking me to do that. And turns out I do have some one by twos that would make a good frame, so I want to make that frame, and she's going to make some rugs. Okay, what else was I going to say? I think that's it. Thank you, Rick, Arkansas Prepper. Thank you, Rick Wallace, Wallace Knife Works. Thank you very much. Uh, golly, was there something else? Oh, I guess that's it. That was a long enough video. 20 minutes. Thanks for watching, y'all. Been a good day.